Hello, my name is Alex States, CEO of Fusion Flight. Arc Marker Turbine Generator has been out for two years now, and the latest generation device is incredibly easy to set up, and I'd like to show you just how easy it is. We begin at the back panel, where two M6 screws are used to secure the positive and negative power lines to your load. The Arc is capable of generating DC voltage in the range of 25 to 75 volts. The copper terminals shown are rated to sustain 150 amps of continuous load. There is a large capacitor installed inside the system, so for safety reasons make sure to always have a load attached when running the system. With the later generation, the fuel ports have been upgraded with the more reliable compression fittings. We continue by installing two 6mm fuel lines to the back panel of the unit. One line for supply and one line for a return. After the fuel lines have been successfully installed, you will be able to use the auto prime function, which will essentially remove any air bubbles from the fuel system prior to start. Now, if it's your first time using the unit, you may need to charge up the startup battery. For that, you can connect the AC charger included in the kit directly to the front panel via a four pin cable. Grab your wired remote control and connect the six pin cable to the front of the panel as well as the three pin cable. Finally, we can press the main power switch. ARC has a fair amount of autonomy. Once started, it will automatically throttle up and maintain a pre-programmed voltage. To start, simply set the toggle switch to the up position and arm the system. Rotate the knob clockwise and counterclockwise to initiate the startup sequence. To stop the system at any time, toggle the switch down and allow the ARC sufficient time to cool down. And you can always find tons more information on the official website, fusionfly.com arc.